Hello, gorgeous beings of light. I have an urgent message that has been sent to me now uh, for two days in a row. Um, and so it's uh, important that I deliver this as soon as I received it. And um, here's the message, okay? The message is basically raise your vibration. They're pounding us with light, pounding us with frequency. And our bodies are not being able to handle it because our vibration is not high enough. So it's super, super important that you raise your vibration, do anything in your power right now to stay at a high vibration. Again, stop watching videos that, are, that talk about anything that could possibly be negative for you, uh, whether it's vaccines or the divide between people vaccinated and not vaccinated or the way people are treating each other forget all of that for now okay for now just concentrate on your ascension concentrate on your body right now this is your priority okay this is the message i'm going to read it just like she delivered it to me she got this from her guide two days in a row um this was a very in your face message you know her guide was right in her face and it was basically saying that humans must raise their vibration to survive what's coming in order to survive the stress of what's going on in their minds he said the emotion even now is very difficult for the human to handle and they have been storing it all within their bodies which is causing disease inside that comes out in different ways part of the reason to raise the vibration is so that they can exist with contrast and have calm within the increased energy and light coming into the earth to assist in raising the vibe is making everybody, everything louder in the mind than before so the human can alchemize it. But if they don't understand this, they won't be able to alchemize it, leading to a path of disintegration. The possible cataclysm that many saw coming in the past was not necessarily an outside catastrophe. It was more like a breakdown of human consciousness that made people transition and now move forward. The frequency being raised will allow them to understand that the outside is a simulated reality already manifested, but to not play in the consciousness of it because we are creating every minute a new one. He has, he has warned her as well not to play too much in that consciousness, the current reality. Um, she asked what she could do, and again, he said, please, please, please raise your vibration, okay? And um, she got another message again today, and that was the message that, um, let's see, the vision, the vision was that she saw a Schumann resonance light, life, life, light effect graph with blinding light. And so the, the, that's what that energy is they're sending us and saying people are now vocalizing how they are feeling in their bodies right now. But this is the ascension, like the beginning in some form, even though it's been on drip for so long now, but someone just turned on the faucet on. The ascension is happening now. There is going to be more light, more light, more light. The human needs to raise the vibration so they can handle this must in capital letters. Now, she did mention that it wasn't a fearful message, but an insistent message. OK, so um, again, I am asking you to please raise your vibration. How do you do this? Oh, my goodness. So many different ways. And um, I had written a book that I never published where I had this information. And I'm looking for it right now. Um, but basically is this, uh, be aware of how you feel, of your emotions. When you feel a certain emotion, welcome it. Tell it you love it, transmute it, okay? Really important. So um, how else do you raise your vibration? You can meditate. You can, um, let's see, you can, <clears throat> let's see if I can get to the end of this. Okay, sorry, I'm trying to find the information for you. Okay, so um, let's see, meditate, 
uh, do uh, tapping, tapping, EFT, right? Look it up, EFT, tapping. Um, let's see, oils, essential oils, uh, crystals that raise your vibration. Use your pendulum to measure your vibration. Ask your guides to raise your vibration. Um, let's see, what else do we have? Flowers, uh, if you like to dance, dance. If you like to, um, if you like to sing, sing. I'm sorry, trying really hard to get to where I need to go here. Okay, here we go. Um, let's see what else we have here. Um, Okay. Eating better. The food that you eat has vibration. If you're eating animal uh, meat, you're eating the, the suffering of the animal. So it's also lowering your vibration. Being thankful. This is huge. Uh, I, I can't tell you how huge this is. Um, I had a friend who had a, a heart math meter and uh, it, it reads the, the, the brain and the and the heart connection uh, uh heart awareness and i had that hooked to myself as soon as i thanked uh the universe for something like it lighted up before i finished the the thankfulness thought in my head so huge 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 to be thankful so start being thankful for things start noticing the good things that are happening around you instead of the negative things keep your chakras balanced uh, grounding, make sure you spend time in nature, ground, stay in the now moment, be of service to other, listen to music that makes you happy, uh, breath work, do breath work, that's really good, forgiveness work, think of positive thoughts, stay away from negative people, listen to singing bowls, crystals, like I mentioned already, um, okay, so, Guys, please, 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 as this, I am begging you, do whatever you can to close everything outside of you. Close it all off. Go within. Go within. Okay? Deal with these emotions that you're feeling. Otherwise, you're going to get sick. I love you, and I'll um, be making some more videos soon. Bye-bye.